Oh, I don't want to become president. Well, today is your lucky day. No, no, no. no. I can't <laughs> touch it. Oh, well, anyways, I got a couple tips for you. And by the end of the day, you'll be in governing shape. Just follow my lead, don't get spanked, and the Oval Office is yours. Step one, arguably the most important one, your appearance. First, your hair. You gotta have a toupee, like wear one, like a wig. But if anyone asks you if you're wearing a toupee, you deny any of the such. Second, your color. You gotta have a strange color face. Orange, green, white, those are all pretty good. Oh, or you could be a lizard if you want. All right, then you gotta have a weird body part, a distinguishing finger, small hands, big head, huge feet, small arms, any of those work. And you gotta have a voice that they're like, really, that guy's our president? How did he make it out of school? Any comments? Um, this stuff seems a little bit unnecessary. I mean, aren't people gonna make fun of me for it? Of course, you run a big company on nurse. I mean, uh, them governs. Well, why should I take advice from you? You don't seem the brightest. Neither is America or your target audience. All right, now we're gonna practice for your speeches, your excellent top-notch speeches. Now, it's about your personality. You gotta have a specific personality. Dumb, rich, delusional, as well as egotistical. Think you can master those? This seems really stupid. Who would vote for me? Hold on, I'm getting there. Things to this area have crazy stories uh, that aren't true, but you say they are true. Um, I never use vocab above fourth grade. You also need really bad ideas, like build a wall, stereotypes, mass deportations, and only campaign in California and New York. Because those are the places that are most likely to vote for you. Now, you're thinking, this seems super stupid. Why would anyone vote for me? Well, that, my friend, is a beautiful thing called the South. Now, go out there and show them what you got. Okay, mm, looking good. Okay, uh, Miss, get that baby off the stage. I'm not going to autograph it. Okay, so why you should elect me? Um, I've never done anything wrong in my life, so why start now? Uh, elected! Alright, come on. No. It's okay. It's okay. Oh. Frick. <laughs>